Hey, what's up? It's Greg here, Fisherman's Headquarters, checking out the Long Beach Island Surf on Wednesday, September 23rd. So here I am, about 10.30 in the morning, checking out the beach here at the top of the incoming. Uh, looks like high tide will be at one o'clock. Got the last of the incoming tide here. As you can see, there's a decent amount of swell still left over from Teddy. Yesterday was definitely a juicy day, uh, but you know, the, the swell's slowly fading today. And as you see, there's definitely a residual swell. Uh, I'd say somewhere in the two to four foot range, occasionally three to five foot on set, uh, but it's somewhat inconsistent, those bigger waves. Uh, that being said, we've got a beautiful westerly breeze. Uh, so far today, it hasn't been too buggy, but normally these westerly winds do bring in the bugs. So if you're hitting the beach, be prepared for that. Uh, grab a little Captain Ron's bug spray. Definitely be in your best interest to be prepared. Uh, with all that being said, there are some fish around. The beaches are cleaning up after this swell and after this blow, and there's definitely good potential to get out and have some fun. The mullet run has begun. Uh, it's been we're about, say, a week into it now. Um, kind of things started to happen on that moon recently. And, you know, with the blow, things have definitely slowed up a little bit, but I think you'll see that kicking the high gear the next few days with the tranquil weather that's in the forecast ahead. Uh, as far as fishing goes, store staffer Frezza was fishing the jetty recently. He had a nice trigger fish as well as some tog. That's probably the best fishing you're to find right now for land-based anglers. With fluke season and sea bass being closed, there are some other species to look at. I would suggest if you're looking to fish in the bay side, blowfish, weak fish, snapper blues would definitely be the best shot at, in, in town. Uh, if you're looking to fish the jetty, there's also, other than tog and triggers, there's also some sheep's head there as well. I would strongly suggest fishing crabs. Um, that's definitely going to be your best bet to have some fun up there. If you guys are going to get ready for the fall, we're fully stocked up here at Fisherman's Headquarters. We welcome you to stop by the shop seven days a week. We're open basically every single day, seven o'clock in the morning till eight o'clock at night. On the weekends, we open a little bit earlier and we close a bit later. Uh, Saturdays, we're open at 5 a.m., closing at 9 o'clock. Sundays, we're also 5 a.m., we're closing at, at uh, 6 o'clock, a little bit earlier on Sunday. Uh, if you're not local to LBI, you're not going to be around the area, if you want to need some help, you know, you're looking for some gear to go fishing, feel free to give us a call, send us a message, an email, uh, or check us out online, fishermansheadquarters.com. If you're looking for an updated fish report throughout the fall season, be sure to check out our fish report blog, fishinglbi.com. There you can find a lot of details of the local fishing forecast, see what's going on as far as reports and photographs, and uh, you kind of get kind of a vibe and see what's going on, the pulse of what's happening on LBI. Have a great day.